explaining the components of it. Um, an opt-in is a page that's designed to collect somebody's name, number, and email. Um, that way you're able to go back and talk to them through email or through text message. And we've pre-built some of those emails for you. Um, but it's totally all yours to communicate with the leads now that you've gathered their, their information. So when it's applicable, I would always send people to these pages first because then you're gonna be storing your contact information. We designed three, one that's just a general page. Um, it gives like a, a guide to travel savings. Um, but when you click the button, it's gonna grab their name, number and email. Um, that way, again, the contact information is stored. So for the general, it has a guide to travel, like a general guide to travel. For the 50 plus, we have a senior travel savings guide. And then for families, we have a guide um, that is designed for family planning. For those of you who haven't seen them, um, I'll do a quick, uh, where are we? Media storage. I'll do a quick little run through them because I'm not sure that everybody has actually seen some of the guides. So for example, we have the ultimate guide to senior savings and it goes over all sorts of different things like planning affordable trips, maximizing travel discounts and all sorts of really, really great information. And what's super, super cool about the guide is that on each chapter, it actually is trying to get them back to your funnel. So there's a link in each chapter saying, this is why you want to use Lavardi. So those are those are the really cool guides that are that are tied into those lead magnets that I don't know if all of you guys have had the opportunity to see. Um, so again, the those three, those three pieces called an opt-in or a lead magnet are the ones that are going to email them um, one of those guides and also be what helps store that contact information in your system. The landing page is a long form page that gives all sorts of information about the program that is designed to help sell your leads. So if you were at the event in, in September, yeah, it was September, um, then you saw me walk through the whole anatomy of this page. So a funnel for not for everybody who has maybe not learned or understood fully what a funnel is, it basically is a psychologically structured web page that is designed to help guide a customer through the buying process. So typically funnels follow a model called ADA, A-I-D-A. So attention, interest, desire, action. So we grab their attention up at the top, we throw out some big numbers, and then we're, we're capturing their interest here. Why are you still paying retail? And then creating this common enemy that way, instead they, they work with us. And then we move into the desire. It's as easy as one, two, three, breaking down the benefits and more benefits and more credibility statements and then FAQs to make sure everything's answered. Um, and within that phase, that is where it should be action driven at that point. So this page does not collect contact information right away. When you click the button, it will go to the order form for one or the other products. So this is where if they did buy, you would have their information. But if you are trying to gather people's name, number, and email, I would recommend sending them through the lead magnet first because the landing page isn't designed to collect information right away. It's um, it's basically like a bridge to the order form. From there, um, we have them create their account. So they create their password and their date of birth. And this is what's gonna tie it to your flight. We're able to make sure that it's all tracked in flight. Uh, date of birth is one of those required fields. So we just make sure that they know that they have to create a password and everything. And then from there, they end up on our thank you page. I think that we've gone through the lead magnet and landing page, but I don't think that you guys all have seen 
the rest of the process. So I just wanted to show you guys what that kind of looked like for them to check their email, start saving and stay connected. So that's the funnel that's in there that is tied to all of your snippets. So I wanna go back and cover what those are again. So here in this marketing tab, Justina, you have, do you do you want to share your screen? Are you not seeing everything? No. Oh my gosh, I've been doing a whole walkthrough of everything. You guys didn't see anything? No, I'm sorry. I I, I finally figured out that you thought you were sharing. I apologize. Okay, what what I mean, you did a great you? job explaining it. Yeah, I mean, I got well, the visual. I see, it. I see it. Like I saw your screen perfectly. Oh, you saw everything I was doing. Did everybody Taylor? else see it? Oh. Yeah. oh, thank goodness. I was like, I was like, oh, I was like, leave off. I was Dad, like, hey, get it together. I don't see oh it. Goodness. I just see all your beautiful faces, but that's okay. okay. You go ahead. Oh, you scared me for a minute, Jake. I'm so glad. I was like, how okay. could nobody? Like, that was at least five minutes of explanation. No, no, that's, that's, we're fine. I apologize. Oh, awesome. Forget everything I said in the last 30 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Cool. Back to our regularly scheduled programming. <laughs> Just gonna reshare your screen though. It yep. went okay. 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 Can you guys see again? I see it. Now Give I us can. a thumbs up. Now I can. Perfect. Okay. okay. So here in your marketing tab, this is what it looks like on the LMS side. We have a list of snippets. You have them designed for both email and text messaging. Um, if you guys are going to do text messages, um, I think that's a big thing that you should walk through again on Monday, Tammy, is the A2P verification. I know we've been getting a lot of emails about some people failing it. So um, I think a lot of them are going to be filing it as a sole prop. So it's a little bit of a different process because okay. you know the difference, right, Tammy? Like, yeah. Can you yeah. explain to them what a snippet is? I know what it is, but they may not. Uh, they're like, what's a snippet? Yeah, absolutely. So these these links here are they they contain a little um piece that is going to auto populate your links so instead of having to remember because your phone number is one of the elements that's tied to your affiliate links so instead of having to type the whole thing out um they are pre-built inside of these links some of you guys were saying that your links weren't working we have pushed an update to make sure everybody should work but if you want to double check just to be sure in your settings here, I'll go back one more time and show you in your settings here, you can scroll to custom values. And as long as everything here has a value, then your link should work now. So we did a big push this last week. Some of you guys were missing those values based off of the days that you signed up, but everybody should be up to date now. And these values are what's held in the snippets. So when you do go and you paste that little value, which is pre-built for you into any of your messages, this is what's going to show up. So 5109628, that's my phone number. So that would be what's attached to it. And that's what carries it over between the Go High Level LMS system and um, the back end. That way, all of your sales can be tracked. So I figured I would show you guys that quick little element just if you guys wanted to double check and make sure and see if you don't have the value for any reason at this point, definitely reach out and we'll make sure they're updated. But at this point, I'm pretty sure everybody has gone. Everybody has been updated. We've been on top of it. Um, Jarolith is one of our really, really great customer service representatives that I'm sure some of you guys have talked to. And I made sure that she went through and was a second set of eyes. So everybody should have their values updated. And that is what your, your snippet basically equates to. So back when you go to the, your conversations, it, you can go and use those snippets. So here at the bottom, you can change a bunch of different things. You can add images, you can use emojis, you can, and here, this little paper, insert snippet. So here are all those snippets that have those links attached to them now. So if I knew somebody who was a mom who had a bunch of kids and I thought, oh, maybe I want to send her this guide, this is the one that I would select and that will autofill the, that will autofill with your link. So I'm not going to send just the link. I'm probably going to say like, hey, um, contact first name and then put a little message in there. 
your message here. Check out this page. Thanks. You know, whatever you want to fill in the email, this is what your link is going to populate us. So then when I go to click send on this email, we'll open that up. And now my link has auto populated. So I don't have to worry about remembering dash life travel.com slash families with my link ID. It's pre-filled. That way you guys can choose any one of those pages that are the most applicable to who you're talking to. So that's kind of a, a more detailed version of how the snippets work, where the values are tied into and how you can use them within the system. But I want to show you another exciting element that is coming out this week, um, which is the travel agent mini course. Um, as a funnel designer and a marketer, I'm going to use a big word. This is called an indoctrine funnel where it basically um, guides them through the buying process via video. So in the first funnel that you saw, the passport light, passport, it was very long page. This is a different style of marketing known as an indoctrine series because it guides them through three different videos instead. So some people like to absorb content differently. Some people are big readers and they want to go through and read everything and know all the details, but other people get more excited about videos. So here in video one, it's that quick 60 second one just to spark their interest. Um, if they're ready for more, we gather their information and then it brings them to the second video. And the second video is an eight minute video that gets a little bit more in depth into the program, gets people excited. And then this button will bring them to a 14 minute video that just goes deep into the passport travel agent sneak peek. If they make it through this whole series, this last button, when they click it, will go um, for them to sign up. We are working on turning this page into a funnel, um, a funnel step. It is still in development mode for it all to be connected together. So right now, this third step goes to this page where they can add it to the cart and purchase. Um, but yeah, that's this is the new funnel that we're going to be rolling out. A couple people have had early access to this and are just so excited about how it's been working. Um, just because, like I said, some people like videos a lot more. Um, so we're really, really excited to be able to push these updated links into your account. Some of you guys actually might already have the snippet for them. They aren't configured yet though. So if you have a value that says um, custom values mini course. So this will be configured right now. Right now it doesn't contain your link ID. So see your passport to savings.com link ID is blank. So some of you might have it already, but you can't use it yet because it will not track. So we will let you know when that update is officially pushed for you guys to have access to that page also. Um, again, some of you might see the value already, but it is not set up to track. So if you wanna send people there just for information, you can, but I wouldn't recommend it just because there's no tracking set up yet. Um, but that is one of the exciting things we're getting ready to roll out. And then one other thing that me and DJ decided this morning that we want to give you guys um, is a new feature they just released at the Go High Level co uh, Conference for QR codes. So you guys are actually going to be able to see this Sites tab now. Right now, you, you don't have access to Sites, but you'll be able to go into Sites and create a QR code because we, we realize a lot of people find it easier to send out a QR code um, instead of a link. So we thought that would be a fun little addition for you guys um, to, to be able to have a QR code too. So you will start to see this feature and you'll be able to see how many people scanned it. Um, and so just a little bit more functionality for you guys. And we're, we're working on so much more than that. Um, so I can't get overexcited right now. Um, but those are going to be the two things that you will see later this week being pushed is that that travel agent mini course uh, being available, and then you'll also have the QR code feature. Uh, the last thing that I wanted to cover that I was getting a lot of questions on are these email templates. So they say do not edit, and but I've, I've let you guys know you can go through them and read them and see if there's something you want to use. 
They are set up to work in your welcome sequence under automations here. And it sends them out in a, a week long, every day it sends the next email. If you guys don't wanna use them, you don't have to have it published. So right now it's drafted. So you can publish or draft it if you want to use it. They're designed um, using a marketing strategy called soap opera sequence. So this is more uh, a sequence that you would use for somebody that might not know you. Um, but a soap opera sequence basically is there to grab their attention and kind of make them feel connected to a story. So if you go through the emails here for, for the series, this series is about um, a man and a woman who had this dream of going to Paris and life got too far and his wife passed away and they never got to go on their dream vacation. But he discovered Lavardi and was finally able to take a trip in her honor. And so through each email, it, it kind of pushes them to go and check out Lavardi. So I, I recommend you guys go through and read all of them. There's a whole strategy as to why there are bold and underlined and colors and stuff. But the reason the name is signed at the bottom, not your name, is probably because most of you guys did not marry a woman named June who passed away before you could go to Paris. So I wanted to make sure that there was a little more context behind what these emails are. So for the families, it's about a mom who's struggling to figure out how her whole family can go on a graduation trip. So unless that's your personal story, then it shouldn't have your name. So maybe for somebody who knows you, it, it might not be the best sequence but that is why it's signed with something that isn't your name. But there's a call to action at some point in these emails. P.S. Want to see what I'm talking about? Click here. And that link is sending them back to that funnel so they can sign up for the program. So I just wanted to make sure you guys had a little bit more context behind these because I know it was a little confusing seeing they weren't signed by you guys. Um, the way that you can send those out on a case-by-case -case basis, um, if you would want to have it go to some people, but you don't want it to go to others, you can leave it as a draft and you can select the contact that you want it to go through the automation. So if I didn't want anybody who jumped in to go through that sequence, but I wanted this contact to, you can select the contact and add it to an automation. So you would select that I want her to go through that workflow and then she'd be able to go through that workflow specifically. So that's a way that if you wanna use it sometimes, but not others, you will be able to do. Um, but then the template that I put here, the standard editable template, this is one that you can open up and you can type everything that you want. You can save the template. If you wanna have multiple templates, you can duplicate it or you can create your own. Um, there are email marketing templates in here for you that you can go through and customize. Um, there might even be some that are specifically travel related, so travel and hospitality. You guys can use some of these templates to reach out to your to reach out to your people. It's super, super simple. You'd select whichever one that you want. So we'll select this one, for example. And you can go in and make it say whatever you want. And that can be your welcome template that you'll be able to go out and use. So we could say, hey, contact first name. And that means every single time the first name is going to be plugged in. I wanted to introduce you or invite you to check out this new opportunity, you know, and you can put your you can put your link in there. So you have your custom value here and you have your affiliate links. You can put any one of those in there. So if you wanted to introduce them to the mini course, you guys can plug that custom value into a button in any email and you can use this as, as your intro email if you don't wanna use the soap opera sequences. So there's there's really a lot of material in here that you guys can take advantage of and use this to send out to your contacts. Um, you can use this template um, when sending it to a contact. Let's see. 
trying to move your faces. It's in the way. Up here, there we go. So you are able to insert templates. Um, no, it'll be for marketing, sorry. Um, you'll have that template and you'll be able to send it out through a template. So you can create a new campaign using that. And based off of your templates, you'll be able to select that and send it out to the contacts that you wanna send it to. So I know this wasn't something that we've gone too deep into, but I wanted to show you how powerful this email tab can be. And that's not even touching the social media element. Like I strongly recommend that you guys connect whatever platforms that you have, because this will actually let you manage and schedule out all of your social media posts. Um, and you can include those custom value links into those posts so it's pre-built for those people to come through. So you could create a, a post on Instagram saying like, hey, I have this guide that I'm giving out for free. Um, I think it'll help a lot of people. Click the link and it will let you put that custom value in there. That way people from social media are coming in here too. So I think that gives a more detailed like explanation of all that's in here and how powerful it really can be. Again, for the people who were worried because their links weren't working, you can just do one more double check by making sure that these values are full. But again, everybody should be up to date. And then um, on Monday, DJ and Tammy will do a bigger walkthrough and go through the phone number services to make sure that you guys are getting verified properly so you can send text messages. So that's kind of the the big reveal, the big walkthrough, and a little bit of a, a sprinkle of excitement towards the new features. Uh, I hope that was helpful and that you guys are really, really excited about the LMS system. Yes, and Justina, thank you so much for taking time this morning. I know it's early out there on the West Coast, but uh, I appreciate you taking the time and all you've done. And it's just really really impressive not only what you've created for us but what you've done at, at such a young age of 25 it's like unbelievable um and and i appreciate you being part of our team and and we're you can jump if you want and go enjoy your day we're, we've got a few more minutes here but you don't need to hang on here unless you just absolutely want to, <laughs> You're welcome to go. okay great guys well um, it was awesome getting to show you guys the system again. Um, we'll let you know when those updates are pushed out. Um, but thank you for listening to my whole spiel this morning and have a All great right. Saturday. Thank you. Take care. Have a great All day. day. All right, guys. One thing I want to say, I want to circle back to the conversation. If you were on here last week, I talked a little bit about prospecting because here's the truth. Like we've got the greatest opportunity in the world, in my opinion. Okay. I really do believe like for the average person to really create a significant business over time with a significant residual income, this is an unbelievable opportunity, right? We've got to all pull together. We've got to make this work because, you know, the way this revenue share pool thing works, we really are one big team. And as this company starts to move and grow and catches some momentum, those of you that are positioned in the pools are going to benefit and benefit in a big, big way. And, and you're going to see, I'm telling you, just remember I said this, once we catch the momentum and the, the, the numbers, the volume, the sales volume is up there and those pulls are increased, you're going to see some incredible checks. And, and, and right now, just understand one thing, we've got percentage wise, we've got more individuals getting paid right now then I, I guarantee you than any other company in our industry. And the reason I can say that is because I understand the other compensation plans. I owned, a, I owned two companies, two different companies that had a binary compensation plan. I understand the numbers, the percentages of people that actually get paid. Many of you were part of the same company that DJ and I were for many years. I sold my company and I merged my company with World Ventures back in 2013. And, you know, I had one of the largest teams at World Ventures. I had close to 40,000 active affiliates in my team. And I can tell you that probably less than eight or nine or 10 percent of the people in that entire company ever got a residual check. OK, so what you had is you had a few people 
I say a few, it was a big company, but you had a small number of people making all the money. We've got an opportunity for anybody to get positioned and pull one through six. I mean, one, one through six, you don't need any duplication. You can just go out and make personal sales yourself. And I'm telling you, the people that get positioned in the pool one through six are going to make a significant income in the future. And the people that get positioned in seven, eight, nine, and 10 have an opportunity to really create some, some, some wealth and some huge passive income. And, but we've got to get out and talk to people, right? And I know, like, you know, I, and I'm sure that as you see, you know, Justina walk through all the different elements of that LMS system and you think about all the videos we have and all the trainings that we have and all the support that we have. You know, I, I keep pointing out the obvious, right? I want you to know that I recognize it can be, if you let it, if you let it, it can be overwhelming sometimes. But what I'm trying to get you guys to do is to find your lane, find what works for you, find that one presentation. And I'm going to share with you what, what works for me and what I'm comfortable with and what I'm using but, you know, find that one thing that you can zero in on, okay? And just know that all of that other stuff is there for you and the affiliates that you bring on. We've got lots of options. I mean, who agrees that options are good, right? We've got lots of options. We've got lots of training. Now, the three videos that I'm personally going to be using are the one-minute video, the little short one-minute commercial that we produced, the eight minute video that DJ did, which was casting the vision, I think is unbelievable. And then the 14 minute video that Michael Catlow did. Now, if you want to use these funnels for cold market or whatever, that's a completely different strategy. But going out and prospecting on a daily basis, me personally, that's what I'm using. And I just I just encourage people to watch those three videos. They're 23 minutes long. If you watch every one of them, you can do it in 23 minutes. And you have everything you need to know to decide whether this is a fit for you or not. So our job is to get out and just get people to see what we do. Okay, the travel industry <clears throat> is the largest industry in the world. I mean, who do you know? How many people in your life, think about this, how many people have you ever met that do not want to travel more? Think about that for a minute. Most people want to travel more. And, and we know the only reason they don't travel more is time or money or both, right? Time or money. Like they either don't have the money or they don't have the time. But I think if people have the money and have the time, people are going to be doing a lot of traveling. And, um, and we know this, right? So we've got something that can help a lot of people. We've got something that people want, but we've got to get out and share it with them. And when I talk about being overwhelmed, Understand that talking to people and sharing the information, that's a concept, right? That's a concept. How you do it or what you say is a strategy and a technique, all right? So you've got concepts, which is talk to people, share the information, get them to look, and then the strategy and technique is how you do that. And understand that strategies and techniques are always going to change. They're always going to be different. We'll probably improve on those three videos. We'll improve on the LMS system. There's going to be more stuff in the future as we evolve that the message will evolve, right? So strategies and techniques, they're, they're always changing. And that's something you have to decide. What strategy, what technique, what video or videos do you want to use? I just told you what I'm doing, right? And, and to me personally, I think it's the most clear and concise way to share our message and share what we really do with other people. But just please, I'm, you know, I, I, the, the only thing that I fear is one of the founders with all this incredible stuff that we have, I don't want you to get stuck and go, I don't know what to do. Okay. Just find something that you're comfortable with and go with it and just go with it. And I'm going to share a script here with you in just a second. I'm going to have not yet, but I'm going to have Sandy pull up a script here in just a minute that I wrote. And I'm going to just kind of, talk to you about <clears throat> a strategy. It's a strategy, right? The concept is talk to people. I'm going to give you a strategy, <clears throat> excuse me, that you might want to use. And, um, but, but like I said last week, we can't, you know, I've always said, look, if you, if you're here 
and you're committed and you don't ever quit, you can't lose. Okay. You cannot lose at this if you don't quit. But that said, you have to get out and talk to people. And I, and I, you know, I asked you guys a hard question last week, which was how many people have you really prospected in the last 24 hours or the last week or the last month? And I mean, I'll ask you again, go back and be honest. I mean, go back and assess the last week. A lot of you were on this call. Most of you were on the call last week. So how many people did you prospect this week? I mean, it only you know, right? And I'm not asking you to share that with us. I'm just asking you to be aware of how many people you're talking to. And if you're wondering why you're not getting the type of results that maybe you want, or you're not positioned <clears throat> in the pools that you want to be, that's probably the reason, right? I think, you know, if you get out and talk to people, again, everybody wants to travel. Most people want to travel. Most people want to travel. Most people that you know uh, want to do more traveling, not less traveling, right? And so we've got something that people want. We've just got to share it with them, right? So I've got, uh, I want to tell you this, this story of this, um, a guy that I've known for many years, and I say I've known him, we've actually only met one time in person, but we've been friends through the industry, over the phone, through social media for many years. And, um, you know, I feel like I know him really well, but like I said, in person, I've only been around this guy one time. And um, he was with a nutritional company a, a, a few years ago, and he was talking to me about a strategy where he was dropping voicemails, dropping voice clips on people's DMs on Facebook, right? You know, you can go in and you can type a message, which is fine. He was dropping these voice clips and he felt like it was a little bit more personal and he was doing it on a large scale. And <clears throat> he actually had a couple of different Facebook pages set up and he was way more aggressive than I would ever suggest anybody be, okay? But he was literally dropping 100 voice clips per day. Now, that sounds like a huge number, and it is a big number, right? And you don't have to go and send 100 messages a day. But it takes about one minute to send a voice clip on Facebook. And he had this thing dialed in, and his, his whole entire strategy, and again, I'm sharing this with you. If you like it, you might want to try it. If you don't, it's okay. There's a lot of different ways to prospect. But he was dropping these, these voice clips, giving them a little bit of information about what he does, Again, just trying to get them to look. Remember I said last week, when you when you make that first call, you're not trying to close them. You're not trying to get them to be a member. You're not trying to enroll them as an affiliate. You're just trying to get them to look. That's all. The person who gets people to look the most is going to win the most, right? I mean, that's all. That's, that's the game. You got to get people to look. So he had this voice clip dialed in, and he was dropping 100 of them per day. And within two years in this company, he built himself a seven-figure annual income. And now he's gone on to start his own company, and he's doing very well right now with that. But he th he built his entire, think about this for a minute, dropping voice clips on Facebook 100 a day and following up with the people that were interested and going moving past the people that weren't interested, right? Remember I talked about the, the flight attendant walking down the aisle with the snacks, you know? I mean, you guys have all been there, right? Would you like a snack? No. Would you like a snack? No. Like, they don't get offended if I don't want a snack. They're just, their only job is to walk down the aisle and ask every single passenger if they'd like a snack. Our only job is to get as many people as we possibly can to see if they will look. Now, some people won't even look, right? I mean, if you, if you get into this cold market, you understand that some people are going to be rude. Some people are going to shut you down. And some people are not even going to have any interest in looking, which is okay, right? You know, there, there's a there's a thing called Sinaloa, okay? S-I-N-A-L-A, -A, Sinaloa. And that stands for Safety in Numbers and Law of Averages. And what I'm going to suggest you do is take a look at this script that I've put together for you. And I'll have Sandy if you can pull it up right now. And this is a this is a voice clip that you can that you can use if you'd like. Um, can you guys see that in the chat? 
Okay. Can everybody see it? Just let me know if you can. Okay. So again, all we're trying to do is get people to raise their hand and go, yes, I would like to look at what you're doing. Okay. So imagine, and, and he was doing a hundred a day. Imagine doing this five times a day, just five times a day it would take you less than 10 minutes to drop five voice clips a day, less than 10 minutes. Okay. And then the people that raise their hand and go, yes, send me the information. You send the information and follow up with them. So here it is. I said, hi, hi, Mr. Prospect, right? Whatever the person's name is. This is Jake Kaborki, and I'm part of a national expansion team for a host travel agency. We are currently looking for individuals interested in working from home, part-time or full-time, earning money in the travel industry. I have three very short videos that I can send that explains how it works, along with all the incredible perks and benefits of being a travel agent. You can watch these three videos in just 23 minutes and have all the information you need to decide if this is a fit for you. Just give me the thumbs up if you're open to checking it out and I'll send it over. I look forward to talking and have a great day. Does that, do you guys see how simple that is, right? It's non-threatening. It's, I think it's polite. You're not shoving the video on them. You can't do that. Don't, don't ever send somebody information that they didn't request. But if you throw that voice clip out there and you read it, just like I said, and make it natural, you know, make it natural, be friendly, have a smile on your face when you're dropping the clip and just do five a day or 10 a day or one a day. I don't care. I'm just, all I'm saying is we've got to get this in front of people. And this is one more way that you can do that. And I think it's a non-threatening, it's a simple way. Um, you know, you, you're, you're, for the most part, now you, a lot of these people you may personally know on Facebook, right? And by the way, I would start with those, okay? I would start with the people you know. Warm market, in my opinion, is always better than cold market. But my God, there's, there's I don't know, there's a, over a billion or multiple billions of people on Facebook. There's all kinds of different groups you can join. I mean, you know, most of you probably have thousands of friends that you're connected with right now on your Facebook. So to be able to go out and find five, five or 10 or 20 a day that you can drop this clip on, I'm telling you, if you do it, some number of people are going to go, yes, Sandy Toes, I'm interested in seeing what you're doing. Please send me those videos. And if we get people watching those videos, a certain number of those people are going to go, yes, I want to do, I want to join you in this. I like this. It makes sense. And a certain number of those people that join you will go out and build teams, right? Some will go out and build a team. Some will be a leader. Some will do nothing, right? But it starts, you got nothing until you start prospecting. You've got nothing until you get somebody to look at what we're doing. But again, get enough people to look. Enough people are going to say, yes, I'm interested. And out of those people that say, yes, I'm interested, a certain number of those people are actually going to join and become travel agents. And a certain number of those people will go out and duplicate and build big teams and get positioned and pull one through six. That's it. Okay, that's it. Now, I know we've got a lot of trainings you can sit in on and we can go through this LMS, you know, every week and talk to you about that. And we can do, you know, we're going to we're going to start doing travel agent specific trainings starting in a couple of weeks where we have like specifically not talking about the business, not talking about building a business or prospecting or recruiting, just talking about the travel agent side. Guys, here's what's really exciting to me is we have an opportunity in direct sales. We have an opportunity that someone can legitimately go and make a six figure income. I mean, you, you guys know there are travel agents. There's many travel agents in this country making multiple six figure incomes. I don't know too many direct sales opportunities that people can join and build a solid six-figure income without recruiting. And so that is exciting. There's a lot of people out there that want to make money from home, but they may not want to be part of direct sales. They may not want to go out and recruit people and build a team. 
You guys do because you're here, right? You wouldn't be on this call on Saturday morning if you weren't interested in building a team and getting positioned in the in the uh, revenue share pools. But a lot, it's not for a lot of people. Just understand that. And we've got a legitimately solid business where people can go and become travel agents and build a six-figure income. So enough of that. I just wanted to share that clip with you. Um, and if you're interested, use it. If not, find what works for you. But, you know, guys, at the end of every week, I just suggest like in Saturday morning is a good time to do it right before you get on this call. Just look back over the week and ask yourself, you know, if, if you're employing yourself, right, you're your own boss. Did you have a good week? Only you know that, right? I mean, that's the best part of employing your own self is, is you can you can work when you want, where you want, with who you want. But that's also the downside sometimes because you're the one that has to hold you accountable. And I just want to wrap up with um, with talking about this uh, cruise that we've got coming up again. If you can bring that flyer up, Andy, on the um, on our cruise, do you have that? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, you know, we've talked about this before. We do have uh, limited numbers of cabins, so if you're going on this cruise, go ahead and put the two hundred dollar deposit down. Do it now. Lock your spot in. Uh, this is going to be, uh, we're calling it a traincation, right? We're going to do training. It's going to have a conference feel to it. Uh, one of the days we're going to take about five or six hours and do some training on the ship, but we're also going to have a lot of fun, right? So this is this is a way to incorporate what we all do, what we're all passionate about, which is travel along with, you know, the traditional conferences that, you know, are a big part of, of what we do, the the training and recognition and announcements and all that kind of stuff. So I don't want you to look at this as a dash life vacation. There's going to be, as we grow, there's going to be many, many, many different dash life vacations that you can choose from. And just, you know, you can't go on all of them. Right. But this is, this is one of our two, um, what I would call conferences that we're going to have next year. We're going to have this one. Then we're going to have a more traditional conference later in the year, probably in, um, in, in late October. So I really want everybody, if you're in this game and you're here to make money and you want to build a business with Lavardi, this is, you know, to me, like this is one of the big events. This is one of those non-negotiables. This is an, this is where we all have an opportunity to come together and get to know each other and build relationships and, and talk and strategize and find out from different people what's working and what you can maybe incorporate in your business. It's where you have an opportunity to get to know me and DJ and Bart and really, you know, see where our hearts are and 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 what how we are about this business and, and how passionate we are about the business. You know, it's where you, I mean, it's it's like to me, when you come to these conferences, it's where you really get Lavardi in your in your heart, right? And you really start developing that, you know, that unshakable belief that that many of you already have, but these conferences are just super important. So again. Limited number of cabins. I don't even know, honestly. I don't know when I say limited. I don't know how many we have, but I do know that it's a set number. So if you're going to go, put your two hundred dollar deposit down, and uh, we'll see you guys in March. So with that, I'm going to wrap it up. Sandy, you got anything else you want to add? Or are we good? Uh, I think I'm good. I'm going to drop. Right. If I can get back to the screen, I'm going to drop the link for the um, cruise. Yeah, and and okay. So guys, tomorrow night. Uh, Sandy Toes and DJ are going to do a little pop-up training going through that LMS system again. If you want to sit in on that, what time is that tomorrow? That is at, um, so it's Monday night, not tomorrow. Oh, um, Monday night, sorry. Monday night, 7 o'clock Eastern, and I just dropped um, the link to sign up for the cruise in the chat. Okay, guys, thanks for being here. Listen, let's make it a good week. Go prospect some people this week, Okay. Go talk to some people. Set a goal. I don't, if it's one, I don't care if it's one, five, 10, 20, whatever works in your life, set a goal and go accomplish it, right? Even if you fail, it doesn't matter if you fail. I'm telling you, you're better off doing it and failing than you are in setting a goal and ignoring it. You're letting yourself down. So get out and talk to some people this week and we will see you guys next Saturday. We're here if you need anything. Take care. Bye, y'all.